G'day there. Um, hey, most of this mess of wires, you will see a little Palulu stepper driver motor board. The green stuff on top is Bluetack holding a temperature probe, which is the white cable. Let's have a oscilloscope hooked up, showing the square wave coming out of my Adreno. I have my amp straws to the stepper motor here. That's not logic or any power for that's not including the 5 volts that's coming from there. That's just from the 12 volt batteries here. I have the temperature of my chip, which is quite low. That's about room temperature, about 3 degrees above room temperature at the moment. It's working quite nicely. It's not very strong at that low power rating. I have the potentiometer turned all the way down. I can stop it quite easily with my hands. That causes it to use more power. Probably not good for it. Um, I can change directions by moving this pin here from positive to negative. If I take that pin out altogether, it often does this weird arguing with itself, trying to go two directions at once thing. I'm not sure what's going on there. Here's more amps doing that too. Probably not good for the motor. I won't do it when it's turned up high. Well, temperature's staying pretty stable there. It's actually dropping because I just turned the current down a bit. So, let's crank her up and see what she'll do. It does have um, over temperature protection. Just making sure that blue takes down hard. So my temperature is accurate. That's why it was dropping. Uh, that's uh, 50 milliamps. That's getting harder to stop now. Let's turn it up a bit more. Ninety milliamps. Oh, I've got to squeeze that really hard to get it to stop. really when I can get the flat on my thumb on my stronger finger that I can stop it. It's a pretty decent little motor. It can actually go up to 2 amps apparently. I don't think the stepper driver would like that. Pushing the temperature probe on with my other finger there. I can't actually touch that without the blue tack. It messes with the way the motor runs. Something about body capacitance. Yeah. Oh, let's just turn that up a bit. There's 400 milliamps going in, and that temperature's starting to pick up pretty quickly now. There's no way I'm stopping that. <laughs> temperature's picking up fast though. Let's go the other way for a minute. Well, let's just see how far it will go before we start getting some protection circuits, and this does have protection circuits. Oh, right way. The temperature's picking up now. 800 milliamps. It's taking it out. It's not sounding good, and there's that, uh, see that stopping and starting? I'll turn it off now. That was the um, either over amp or over temperature protection kicking in. I'm guessing that would have been over temperature protection. Oh, yep, yeah, even through the blue tack. That's my finger actually cooling that now. Um, that's pretty warm. Well, there you have it. I have a stepper motor moving, uh, mostly controlled from the Adreno. If I was more clever, I would have been able to make that direction change pin go high or low with the computer programming. Thanks for watching.